Hey, what's going on there, everyone? It is Techwares, and today I'm going to do an unboxing and installation of the TP Link BE6500 Wi Fi 7 and Bluetooth 5.4 PCIe adapter. Alright, so I got this from Amazon. I ordered it yesterday, it came in today. Uh, I'm basically up, upgrading from my uh, previous um, network card, which is this one. It's from uh, SionCon, and this one uses um, Wi-Fi 6E and Bluetooth 5.3. So I decided to upgrade to the latest technology, which is Wi-Fi 7 and Bluetooth 5.4. So let me just give you some information first. This one, the SionCon network adapter. I purchased it. I purchased it uh, last year in March, March 2024, for forty-three dollars from Amazon. Now this PCIe wireless uh, network adapter, uh, network card adapter, works on PCIe one, four, eight, and sixteen. It does not work on PCIe. AGP and the others so I removed it from my system which is the Optiplex 5050 system unfortunately the system does not have built-in Wi-Fi so I had to purchase these cards and this one honestly it's been fine it does come with an antennas and also um, a low low profile bracket that I have installed right now so honestly, um, it's much cheaper than this one right here. So honestly, it, it's probably be about maybe like forty dollars difference, maybe forty five, maybe even fifty dollars in difference by the time I uh, this video goes up. So if you don't care about the latest technology, then honestly, this one is pretty fine. Wi-Fi six E, Bluetooth five point three. Put that to the side. Now I'm gonna pause the video so I can take this out the box. Because I do need two hands to uh, unbox this, so give me a second. So here it is. First thing you see is the quick installation guide, which is pretty straightforward. I don't really need to read this and go through it. So put that to the side for now. And here's one antenna. Second antenna. Here's the network card itself. Here is the low profile bracket, which you need to install. It does already come installed with a standard bracket. And I'll be showing, the, showing you that in a second. And here is the cable to connect for the Bluetooth. Okay, so this goes into the card itself. And this goes into the motherboard, which for me, it's, put these cables to the side, it's that one right there. Okay, let's see what's below. Just, uh, just for the driver installation information. I think this is going to automatically, uh, Windows is going to automatically detect the network card and it's going to automatically download the driver. So, it says it can't find or connect to the 6 gigahertz uh, band uh, Wi-Fi. Gives you instructions here. And I really haven't seen this in for many years. I don't know whose PC even or desktop even has a CD drive these days. However, it does come with a lot of handy mini CD to install the drivers. Now let me pause the video and get this out the kit, the little uh, packaging. So there it is. There's the TP link. Okay, this is the Archer model. I guess that's the model name. It's the Archer, T, uh, Archer TBE 
400E and the BE6500 Wi-Fi 7 Bluetooth PCIe adapter. Okay, so that's it. Now I'm gonna remove the standard bracket. I'm gonna install the low profile bracket because that's what this case is. It's a small form factor and you just install it right there. Okay, give me a second to do that. So just like that. I removed the standard bracket. I got the small form factor bracket or low profile bracket installed. Now I'm just gonna pop it into my PC right now. Apologize if you're not able to see very well. Oh yeah, let me plug in the actual the Bluetooth uh, cable right now give me a second and there we go got it installed there's the Bluetooth connector as well I'm just gonna try to tuck everything in the cables are good there we go I have the case closed now. All there is to do is install the antennas. That's fairly simple. They just screw on just like that. Make sure you have them, oops, you can just point them any direction you'd like. Install the second one here. And there we go, now all I have to do is Plug everything in and hope you know nothing got bricked while I'm just touching everything and installing that. And yeah, uh, I'll install the drivers. Maybe Windows will detect the drivers and install them themselves uh, itself. And yeah, guys, um, that is that for the TP-Link BE6500 Wi-Fi 7 and Bluetooth 4.0. Uh, sorry, 4.4 um, 4 Bluetooth uh, adapter, and this is this was eighty dollars from Amazon. Now the thing is with this, let me see if it says it here. Uh, sorry, if you can't see, it only works. I'm trying to focus right now. Oh, it only works with Windows 7. Sorry, not Windows 7. Windows 11, 64-bit. It does not work. Well, they say it doesn't work with Windows 10 and below. So I don't know how that how true is that. But yeah, of course, six six gigahertz, up to uh, two thousand eight hundred and eighty megabytes per second. Five gigahertz up to two hundred, sorry, two thousand eight hundred and eighty, and two point four gigahertz up to six hundred uh, and eighty eight megabytes per second. Okay, it says broader coverage. Superior Wi-Fi reception, low profile bracket, or fine security, I'm not sure, you know, it's just a just bunch of fluff and stuff like that, Bluetooth 5.4. Um, thank you guys for listening, thank you guys for watching. Once again, if you don't want to spend 80 bucks on that, I highly recommend the Con PCIe uh, wireless and Bluetooth adapter. Once again, this is like 40 bucks. Okay. And that is it right here. It does also come with antennas. All right, it does come with a low profile bracket as well. And what's cool with it, what's cool as well, it does come with a screwdriver. So if you, when you need to remove the bracket, you need, you need a screwdriver and this comes with a screwdriver. This one doesn't. 
So that's it for today, guys. Thank you guys for listening. Thank you guys for watching. Take care, everyone. Peace. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. I'll be happy to uh, reply. Take care.